Yeah, it's also the Camille's uh, true damage, of course, ignores my W. Yes. Mundo angle? Mundo is really good against these three champions, yes. Mundo is actually extremely, extremely good here. I uh, go to a uh, chill playlist, Spanish playlist, because we're gonna be suffering for like 20 minutes until we scale. I don't know many players in this game by name, so let's see. But I also haven't played too much high elo recently, so in EOS that is. All good, let's go. Doran's Blade Aatrox, exactly the way he's supposed to. Uh, we're playing this matchup like any Mundo matchup. We're a heart losing until we are able to just, uh, you know, get some priority. And uh, that's usually after Warmogus. If I get some Q's level 1 here, it'd be massive. We missed. Dude, my FPS is not chilling. I do not want to get is zoned in the first lane. It's worth of XP. It's W. I'm getting zoned from some XP. There's not a lot to do about it. I think it's okay. Nice poke onto him. I gotta be careful for his level 3. I'm not playing with flash, right? So, I gotta be relatively careful here. He's lost the XP as well. He should be level 4. <gasps> Plus one, baby. Decent. 19. I haven't lost the XP. He did. Nice. This bounce is gonna be pretty impossible to do. I guess I should have perhaps hard pushed this, but even that I think was very hard. There's a good chance I just have to base TP on a terrible wave state here. But there's no other option. I'm trying to get as much out of this wave as I can. Because bone plating. If we can get this bounce in, we're gonna be in an amazing spot. But realistically, he should stop me from getting this bounce in. Oh, he's not doing the best job here. I'm gonna be honest, guys. If I get this wave in, it's kind of over for him. Am I getting ganked? I am. Oh. We lived. Fortunately, Ivan wasn't there. Ivan was top side, but just living is so good. Talia came from a full clear and gang top and didn't get it. If it wasn't for Talia, I would have gotten that wave in and that would have been massive. I'm actually, for once in my life, gonna buy a pink court here. And so we gank mid instead, then we died 2v1. That's what I'd like to see. Okay, at least we traded. Oh my days, the game is looking rough. Really sad that there was a Talia and my jungler wasn't there, but... Not much I could have done about that scenario, I believe. Alright, we're just gonna bounce. We're not gonna be forced to walk up for lasses, but we did lose our TP and we lost quite some XP. But at least we'd survive the gank. I mean, yeah, we're just playing max range Q poke. Unless it's... Butler is not looking too hot. Okay. Well, we've done pretty good here. I'm gonna EQ this so I get the cannon. Being even, honestly, is extremely good in this position, especially because I got ganked as well. Ah, we're dead even in CS. Meanwhile, team. Everywhere my jungler's playing, she's losing. They get dragon. Oh, he has teleport still. I completely forgot. I mean, my team is grieving the game, though. I mean, Aatrox gets a very chill game here. He doesn't have to do anything. He gets a counter matchup, gets his jungle to help him, and he gets full winning team. Okay, but this guy's also terrible. So I guess he needs it. I mean, maybe we can skill. We do have Azir, Ivern, Mundo, but not in this pace. I don't know what this Pike wants to do now, but I don't think we can kill Nightshocks. Well, that's pretty good. I'll get some assistance too. I'm gonna slow push this wave. The reason I do is so that I can hard push this wave and get under the turret. If I have a hard push this wave, it's gonna be a little bit awkward for me to push the next one. Staying for the plate would be ultra grief. I'm not gonna uh, buy Bramble. It simply delays myself too much this game. I'm gonna lose the plate here, but I do get a beautiful Rikao. Uh, I should never be even in this matchup, and I am. So, uh, I mean, if you've seen any of my Mundo games, I always will cite it. If you farm even in lane, you are winning. But my bot is 1 and 7, so we're not looking too hot in general. Will we stop at the first changer teammate? Probably not, but let's see. I don't want to continuously grind this challenge. I also want to get my main account to Challenger. We have eight days left. I thought I had two weeks left, but apparently it's eight days. So that does definitely uh, decrease my time window. Okay, I thought it should run out. Strike. Can be a little bit of a piggy. Should be fine this much. 
Feels like a deja vu. I've only had one loss today, and uh, well, I was against a volley bear, and I was playing window top, and I had an Ivan jungle. But that game, my bot lane turret was gonna minute nine. At least this one, they held on to level 11. I think this is just one of those games, guys. 20% of the games, you're automatically losing, and uh, I, I do believe it's just one of those games. Gotta kill him fast. I guess I should have hit. I thought it just ult earlier. And there's an Ezreal. I think we could have perhaps actually killed him if I hit. I don't know. Not sure if I made a mistake there or not. I bought two pink wards this game. This is a rare one. I shouldn't buy pinks when I'm this behind. I'm not behind, but my team is. I think pings are generally just better when you're ahead, right? You can get some picks from a defensive pink court, but the one thing that's good at least is that my teammates are building full damage, right? They're still building full damage, which is good. Well, they took the whole top lane turret down. I want to try and use the one and a half minute that I have to get some plates, but if I'm enemy team, I'm going to be playing for these grubs, which is, of course, their smartest play. And I got to put Ezreal mid, but Talia might use one turn for dragon, so maybe, just maybe, I can get some plates here, which would be massive. If I'm Echo here, what I'm doing is just clearing the wave. He's bolt. Okay, I can get some plates, but Aatrox might have teleport. I'm going to greet here, by the way. I'm going to still go for the plates. I absolutely have to. I'm not going to be winning this game by going even. That's good. Well, we got the two plates. We good, actually, because they're also not going to get six grubs as a result of that now. If Azir can get strong, he can always hold side lanes against both of them. So can I. Like, I'm pretty strong compared to the Aatrox. This is a very cheap item, right? I have tier two boots now, too. I'm going to get Bramble fast and go hard still. Azir should get this if Echo stops side. Azir should keep pushing. Getting golden Azir is massive this game, too. Echo is top side. Azir should get this 100%. This guy needs to play well, though, if we want to win this game. Good. I think they can't kill me. No, I'm dead. Although, they're entering tempo again. Ezreal's here, too. But entering tempo. We're gonna get mid tier 1 even- Oh, he died. I think we can maybe even get mid tier 1 from this. They're 4 top, they got nothing. I got the wave before. Right, Ezreal keeps moving into side, but... Uh, at least my mid laner, or my AD carry is able to farm because it just sucks that the Azir died to Echo. And we somehow still died. I don't know, it is a tough game. I can't really kill Aatrox in side lane as a Mundo. That is not my job. Right, I'm counter the other day here. I do skill very well. Nice, actually. Okay, Azir has Rabadons now. That guy's a monster. If we can delay one of the dragons, that would be massive. Oh, I don't want him to get that. <laughs> Enemy team is making some mistakes, at least. I do think we scale better as a team. Echo two items, Ezreal's two and a half, so is Azir though. Ivor no flesh, Azir no flesh. Okay, so neither of my carries are flesh, that's pretty terrible. Ooh. Head Ezreal. Oh, I may have it. I most definitely hit it. Although? Hmm. I don't have that much gold this game. I just farmed even with Aatrox with just my job. We need Ivern to save us. Nice, Rakan entered. Ultra hard. Let me kill Mori, Azir's TPing. I need to land that. I'm gonna go on this guy. We're guaranteed to get a turret from this. If I land my Q, we get Baron. Ah, uh, she was already going. Good decision by Natalia. If she dies, we get Baron. I think we can with Azir and me tanking. Please, we should do this now. That Talia is a terrible human being. We do skill them. Echo might want to give a shot on too. 
out of pure desperation. Thank you, Echo. Well, well, well. I still owe myself one of those. We just got to deny the soul point now. They are just inting. I don't have to recall now. I'm gonna stop this first. I don't know, man. They have no idea how to play with their lead. Their top lane has zero kill participation, but I don't really think it's Aatrox's fault as well. Ultimately, the Rakan into two turns. Them making that play on me on top lane is, is just stupid. And he into this combo on the pike. And then Azir, a nice flank TP. And also, they gave some shutdowns earlier, especially when they lost here. I need somebody to push this out, please. Ah, Brambo is into me. I would not want to be that Aatrox. I think I'm just gonna hit this under his nose, no? I think I am. I'm a little strong now, guys. That guy's a big Sedge. Yep. Good mental this game by me and my teammates. I just had to deafen all of them. I did feel like we had a better draft. We gotta play for this now. I can get this. The model should come, yep. I promise you you don't want this. Nice guys. I'm gonna get level 16 guys and we are unkillable. <laughs> Who said that, Yusuf? Accurate representation of what Eddie Carey sounds. True or false? As your solo carry, do you see this top gap, my guy? I, uh, I aspire to be a humble man, but... Uh, this top gap is about as big as they come. I am back to full speed, baby. Oh, you guys thought you had me. But well, I'm level 16 Mundo. Pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you guys. Hey, pleasure. Hey, my pleasure. Hey, my pleasure. Hey, my pleasure. Hey, what's up, bros? Oh, guys, stop playing there. Ah! Level 16 Mundo is the, one of the biggest spikes that exist in the game because, and a lot of people don't know this, at rank 3, both healing effects are increased by an additional 5% per nearby enemy champion, aka roughly translates to you cannot die. That's what it translates to. You can't die. Can this Tinder terrorist guy stop inviting me? Guys, she said yes in brackets. I asked her if she has a boyfriend. <laughs> Set matchup, eh? What are you playing to say it? Mundo is all right, I think, because I always have my passive for his first E. So I think Mundo just rocks it here. The only issue playing Mundo into set, I have like 7k HP. And if he grabs me, his ult deals uh damage based on the hp that the target has that's, that he owes i don't know how else to say that in a in better english basically if you have a shit ton of his hp his old if he holds you will deal shit ton of damage to your teammates so there's that if he goes bork you're ruined no <laughs> blade of the ruined king if he goes bork you are ruined <laughs> bro i'm vibing i'm eating gordon bleu and watching what is gordon bleu that sounds like cheese snitchel with cheese and ham in the inside yeah that is disgusting by the way that's like genuinely putrid oh i eat chicken with ham and cheese inside what yeah that, that's what i thought it was i used to eat it as a kid unsubbed l take guys i will die on that I will stand on my hill like a soldier. That food! Unsubbed, unfollowed, and unremembered. Okay, that's too far. He's kind of like tagging in and out of his Q range. He's not using it though. He's D shoot. That's terrible. He should go D ring. Yeah, this dude is no damage, bro. All right, we got five in the grass smoke. I'm alright with that outcome. Maybe Q start was still better, but I don't know. What? How does a Vladimir kill a set? Whoa, that E looks cool. What skin is that? What? That looks... So I genuinely never care about skin, but that looked amazing. You'd know if you play Morda. You sound like a, like a needy girlfriend. If he wanted to, he would. Shut the f*** up. I 
I I wanna I wanted to hit him obviously. I don't think I've lost XP, did I? That means I get level six on this wave, but I'm actually not I didn't verify it. No, I think I, no, I lost some XP for sure. Yeah, I lost three melees. I need three melees. That's what. Yeah, that's what's up. I need three melees. That was a beautiful E by him. This guy's a goat. He's gonna level six as well, I guess. Now the question is, do I teleport? I think I don't. I want to see hard pushes. If you hard push, I might have to. No, I don't have to teleport here. Maximum lose like one or two melees. We're completely valid without teleporting here. Alright, this guy is terrible items. LS would flame him. Aloys, you kind of look like Mundo when smiling without beard. Yeah, I mean, I guess I'm looking like a Giga Chat. We gotta do a Mundo cosplay on the Subathon. I'll do it. He's gonna have to hold one of us to escape. Looks like it's me. All I had to do was just farm even. All we had to do was follow the damn train, CJ. Put a phone over one of your headphones, rolling on the floor, laughing, yeah. rolling on the floor, laughing. Nice death, by the way, Piggy. Oh, like, am I supposed to laugh at that one, by the way? Ah! An enemy has been slain. I guess this items were good. I guess I just wasn't familiar with this gameplay. Thank you for 100 bits, guys. Aww, oh, thank you for 100 bits, guys. Aww. If I have shoulders like Mundo, we're vibing. This guy just looks like a giant Giga Chet because he has massive shoulders. That's right. Shut up yourself, by the way. Where's my HP? <laughs> nice! There you, baby, baby! What is Mundo doing, though? He didn't expect my spacing slash fundamental slash mechanical skill to come on his forehead. That's a terrible teleport. I gotta dodge his E and he can't ult me. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh, now he can't kill me. If he ults me, he just ults my passive. This guy is mad. He's actually seething. Why is somebody breathing in my neck again? Yeah, besides the like 2v1 that the Mordekaiser are won, we're pretty much vibing. We just into there. He's here? Oh, that's a mistake, baby. Even if he gets like one kill, maybe two. Okay, never mind. He's gonna kill the Vladimir and get the shutdown. And then maybe he can TP top as well. No, he doesn't have TP. Okay, so he gets a lot, right? He gets two shutdowns. In terms of gold trade, we're still trading equal here. Build, this is no damage. Yes, you go Warmax for lane sustain. You're permanently on the map, so you're always gonna have more resources. Oh. I don't know, man. What's wrong with them? They can't kill me, bro. I'm a bad. Thing. The nice part, what? The nice part about Warmax as well is that you're always full HP, right? So I can even farm drone camps, and afterwards I'm just gonna get back to full HP, anyways. I am not surviving this one though without hold. Oh, 
never mind. I wanna stop them. I need to create distraction so my Shaco can come at least. Maybe I stalled enough. Nope. Not go. I don't know why we are not here. Rom? It's very hard to lose the last dragon here. I think I have enough tempo for this. Bro, what are they doing? Enemy teams. Are th okay, never mind. The set is completely griefing. And now we're gonna do the Warmog's healing trick. Right, so he loses half his HP, I lose half my HP, and boom, we just go back to full HP. It's so disgusting. Nobody can match you. I'm basically Garonchka, but on steroids. Does that make sense? Next wave, we have it. So as long as I trade where I can get killed, I always benefit. And I'm always back to full HP. The e ult was smart, I guess. My bad. Okay, I didn't. F I forgot about e ult. So my passive would save me. I we all die here. They're gonna get Nash, by the way. This guy's no flesh. <clears throat> a little plus one. I think they just started here. Hello, Jim. Hello, Jim. Nice roll you play, buddy. Ooh, who did he take? Vladimir! Vladimir! Like this. Oh, he's back to full. We gotta play for this. I mean, this is what I mean. I just think more guys are use this champion. He got the one to be one into us, but it's mainly because I just made a mistake. All I had to do was just farm even. I, uh, Vladimir is a little bit strong. Oh. Jin. 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 Bye, I'm on the what item do you build first? I build Warmox every game first. Warmox first every game. Ah! <laughs> and they. What? My Garen and Nessus are ban. Well, at least one left. What is this? Hello? Why are they banning my champions, man? We're banning my Garen and my Nessus now? Is that what we boiled down to? Hey, I don't like that. Alright, we're full Grandmaster game. We're against Fura again. I mean, I will still scale like a monster this game. They have 0% of child damage. I just need to be able to scale. Alright, the main goals just farm even. He doesn't have airy uh, uh, precision. Flash Ignite. He has a more like scaling oriented setup too. I think we're just both gonna be scaling. He just doesn't know that I hard outscale him in terms of 1v1, so that's a vibe. And we already failed. Oh, I lost the caster. I think I lost the XP as well. I'm not too sure. Oh, I think he lost the cannon. Nice. Not sure if it's worth for me to take his Q there for two casters, but I think my boy Mahadas, I actually wasn't aware. I have my old jungler in the fuse kits it was Hades. Oh, he just wasted his W. He has a phase or so. And save him. The Ranger surfed. Oh, well, he's back to Pooch I guess. It's fine, we'll south skill, but just a little bit insufferable to lay it's insufferable to lane against. Oh, I got all of them, guys. What are you doing, bro? I gotta get this wave to crash. I don't want to lane here against a Vladimir. Oh. 
Cure two boots and phase rush. What can I do against that? And now wave is bouncing. Is gonna get very tricky. You just can hold the wave of your perm, that's so boring. Brainless gameplay. It's fine, I'm just not scaling him. I mean, guys, we're super close to Warmogs, then we can start progressing more aggressively. This guy hasn't really done much. Like, I still a hard at skill him, right? He's W maxing. I need 1.3k gold and I'm him. Oh. Alright, now we'll have Warmogus and we can play the game. I mean, now we have Warmogus, so I just have infinite sustain, right? Like I said, Blamer did not do enough in lane. Where even in farm, I got one kill, I got one cheeky, cheesy kill on him, and now I'm gonna be able to scale like a monster. Final cannon wave. Oh. I guess I did not want me to get plates in uh, Unity. I have a guard too. Problem? Please don't cancel me, he's gonna cancel me. We had little fight between me and him, honestly, the rest of the game. Told you guys, Hades will get back in the game. He's my goat. If he auto attacks me now, I apply anti heal. I can get a slusher maybe. <gasps> he is so lucky, man. He's not flushing me. He's not auto attacking me. He's aware of my war mocks. <sighs> ah, terrible death. I give him the two to two. Might be dead. Oh, oh he's flush. I'm hinting. I figured out he has flush. Can flesh just go grasp some skill way harder? No. Well, he could, but then he has no escape to me later on. I'm getting perma ganked by this guy. I mean, it's worth, I guess, but not for me. Ah, uh, three turns in a row. I just spawn, die, spawn, die, spawn, die. So I have been. Uh, yeah, this guy's gonna be level 40 now. Uh, generally problematic here. Four death in a row. I mean, I just grief my game. I'm an inter. No way they're making this play on me, right? Where's my team, bro? Why is my team ever in these plays? I guess they can just roll it as four. I don't understand, though. That charm was beautiful. Oh, it's 1v9 charm. 
I don't know why how they are always just there though and my team ain't. That charm was full over nine. I mean I, I can't just be coping here, but I, I, don't, I don't we have Baron? Do they just have full control over the whole river? I don't get it. I have Nafiri or anybody there was like one second. We, uh, they are all dead. I don't have W or ult, so I can't escape him. I got molested. I, I'm gonna fuck my puff. I'm done actually. Finally, something could happen for me. They're just here, by the way. Like, it's fine with me. We do something useful. There's a flush. Oh, there's a plant. Full level 16. I'll be useful. Getting top one more time. Well, that's bad. Today we are gonna do a coaching in the top lane. <laughs> I think they can't do much with the Baron now, by the way. We were able to push in all the waves. They just have a bot wave, that's it. Just do that to the Ranger now, we're chilling. He's gonna have E again. What do I do against that? Just let him mundo for you, baby. Didn't even swipe it. I wanted the Ezreal to E into me, thinking he's like fine. And then the second he E's, give him the face. I think we just play this, I guess. Carmel's kind of uses anyways. Alright, guys, with this, we're gonna have a lot of AD. Take a look at Nafiri's AD. 535. I'm thinking I'm matching that. Nah, bro, I'm him. Wait, what's my ping doing? No! Baby. I'm everywhere! Don't expect he either the. I don't th I think he, he expected the headshot combo there. Who else? Oh! 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 Munda at 800 AD! Oh, where's my pretty forehead? Get the auto lights. Oh, let me jump on Munda again! Alright, let me do this. I'll make some love to this turret, right? So. Time for this one to get a little bit of attention. Mundo scaling. I ganked up again, bro. Oh! Hey!